I'm here to make the difference between especially and specially. This is a question from one of our friends on YouTube, especially on this channel. Today, I'm sure I'm going to make you clear on especially and specially. First, the pronunciation. Especially. Especially. The stress is here. Especially. 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 And specially. But it's specially. When speaking, you say specially. 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 It's specially. This is pronounced as specially. And this is especially. You know, especially. 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 Okay? Especially. And both of them are adverbs. Let do say adverb. To let this adverb. And when you say especially is the adverb of the word special. It's not special, it's special. When I say that, special, special, okay? Not special. It's a special day, not a special day, you know? It's not specially, it's special, specially. Okay, the adverb is specially, specially, good. And you have to know where and how to use especially at the same time where and how you can use specially. So this is what I'm teaching you today because it might be confused when listening to people using either especially or specially. Let's get started with especially. Especially is used to say that something is more significant or cheap. Generally, the word especially means particularly or in particular. All right, I got some examples. Lorsqu'on parle de especially, ou utilise especially pour parler d'un bagage qui plus significatif. Il capable de dire en général en particulier. For example, you can cite um, some trees or some animals and you say this animal in particular. Animal ça en particulier. Animal ça bien spécifique ou fixé sur animal ça ou bien fixé sur plante ça. Or you're talking about subjects. On parle de sujets à l'école, mathématiques, français. Mais ou dit mathématiques ou bien français en particulier. Ou fixer you là dedans. Let's say on parle de especially. For example, let me give you an example to let you understand. If you say she loves flowers, especially roses. There are a lot of flowers. Il y a un pile fleur. Mais on dit lire mes fleurs. I would say, I'm going to say, in general, there are several flowers. But more precisely, I'm going to say, I'm going to say, rose. Okay? I'm going to say, rose. Or, in all flowers that have won, it's rose, especially the rose. That's what I'm going to say. Okay? So, she loves flowers, especially roses. She loves flowers, but in particular, roses. I'm going to say, but especially, Rose que les aimer. Ok? Donc, l'on parle de un bagage en particulier ou utiliser especially. Second examples, animals, especially rabbits, love eating carrots. Animals, especially rabbits, love eating carrots. On dit animal yo, plus précisément, ou bien spécialement, lapin, on aime manger carotte. Donc, moi, cité animal, yo, mais moi, fixé son catégorie pour me dire spécialement animal, ça, mais lire même manger carotte. D'accord? So, you use especially to talk about a particular thing. Ou utilisez especially pour parler d'un bagaille en particulier. Ok, good. And next thing, you use especially to emphasize something. Ou utilisez especially pour capable accentuer son bagaille. Let me show you. I am especially grateful to all of my family and friends who supported me. I am especially grateful to all of my family and friends who supported me. Donc, moi dit, moi, reconnaissant spécialement envers famille avec Zamimio qui te supporte. 
Donc, ou pèse spécialement sous famille avec amis mieux. D'accord? Ou accentuer sous un groupe de monde. Ou bien un bagay. Les ça, ou capable d'utiliser, especially when emphasizing. Ou capable d'utiliser lorsque ou accentuer. Un second exemple. I'm especially tired after a long day working. I'm especially tired after a long day working. So you see, you use especially to emphasize on something. Ou est que vous utilisez especially pour capable accentuer son bagage. But remember, you see that we use the verb to be with especially. But remember, do not say especially I am. You cannot say that. Especially. So you cannot say especially I am. You have to say I am especially. Okay? You cannot say that. Especially I am. It's not good to say. Ou pas capable de dire especially I am. Je n'ai pas exemple là de I am especially. I am especially tired. I'm especially grateful. You cannot say, especially I am. All right, good. Now, let's go to specially. How can you use specially in a sentence? So, you use specially to talk about something that has a particular function or purpose. Okay? Specially. Ou utilisez specially pour parler d'un bagaille qui gagne en fonction particulier ou bien en objectif. Objectif bagaille, ça, c'est pour tel bagaille. Objectif bagaille, ça, spécialement, c'est pour tel bagaille. Mais c'est pour ça qu'on utilise « specially ».« Specially » signifie « spécialement ».« Especially » signifie « spécialement ». Ok? Par exemple, « This dress is bought specially for Flags Day ».« Rat ça a été acheté spécialement pour faire des drapeaux ». So you see, « Flags Day »,« There is a purpose, there is a reason here ». Il y a une raison, il y a un objectif là qui fait rade ça à acheter. The purpose is Flags Day. The dress is bought because of the Flags Day. Flags Day is the purpose. Flags Day, c'est l'objectif qui fait rade dans acheter. Ok? This dress is bought especially for Flags Day. Good. Let's go now to a second example. The application is specially designed for hiding the client's computer's IP. The application is specially designed for hiding the client's computer's IP. You dit application ça spécialement faite pour cacher IP computer client. Yo. Why? The application is designed for hiding the client's computer's IP. So, there is a purpose here. There is a purpose. Ça veut dire nous sommes capables d'utiliser especially lorsque nous parlons d'un objectif. Tel bagaille fait pour yon raison. Ça a fait pour telle raison. Ok? This dress is bought especially for Flags Day. There is a reason or purpose. And the application is specially designed for hiding the client's computer's IP. Is, there is a reason here also. So, you have to use specially when there is a reason or when there is a purpose or a function. And there is a case where you can use both, either especially or specially. Il y a des cas où utiliser les deux, soit especially ou bien specially. So, let's see in this example. The speech was written either especially or specially for the occasion. The speech was written especially for the occasion or the speech was written especially for the occasion. Ça veut dire, dans le cas, vous capable soit de dire especially ou bien specially. So, to finish, you have to use especially when you want to talk about something in particular. And you can use especially when there is a purpose or a function, you have to use specially. Thank you for watching. Merci parce que nous regardons la vidéo. J'espère que vous répondez aux questions en mien qui te demandent une différence qui gagne entre specially avec especially. Donc, merci à mien Claire Kounia. 
Si les pas clair, il toujours poser des questions. Si vous même tout sujet, ça te connaît quoi, si vous avez pas problème, vous êtes capable de faire une connaissance, vous avez des questions, et si vous comprenez bien, vous avez connaît tout, et ça fait content le fait que vous comprenez le sujet, et que réellement, la vidéo, ça va venir aider. Merci beaucoup, nous vous tout à l'heure. Bye.